Total Family Care has been serving families in the Washington, D.C. area for many years. And in 2004, Gail Event, along with five other families, at her kitchen table started a mission. I decided to start an organization to help other parents and youth understand the importance to get mental health, how to get the mental health, and how to shape their voices so that they could be heard. And then we, we are a provider of services. We do peer support work. And I think um, I'm probably the first organization in the District of Columbia to come up with a peer support program. These peer support workers take to the streets daily to work with these families, giving them direction and hope. Every day is, is something new. You know, you might have uh, one day, you might be scheduled to go see this client, and out of the blue, you get an email, you got to see another client, and another client. You might got to see three or four clients out of a day. It's very, very good, because you, you get to help other families. And that's one thing we're about at Total Family Care. We just don't focus on the client, but we also focus on the family too. Gail's organization will become a de facto parent. Our, our, our families are so uh, dysfunctional, to say the least, and that they're ill-equipped to even begin to deal with uh, when you do an individual service plan or a family service plan. So Gail's operation technically becomes a de facto parent. The team of Total Family Care say they believe in a holistic approach that ultimately encourages and gives these family members a voice. I see it uh, as families um, becoming more confident in their abilities, um, becoming more able to advocate from their, for themselves and their children, and also gaining a better understanding of how to navigate these systems. And we've even had uh, parents that go on to become um, peer specialists and work with other parents to share that knowledge and, and information that they've gained. I was in a situation when I first came to Total Family Care Collision, I came for help. Me and my sons became displaced in the District of Columbia. I lost my job and I lost my apartment. Now I'm being in a situation where I can get back and help. It's, that's why I keep saying it's fulfillment for me because I understand how it is to be, you know, where the people are that we're assisting. To be where I'm at now, to reach out to another family in any way I can, whether it's resources, um, just sometimes when you get a phone call, you can hear it in another mother's voice. Just to relate and to let her know that it can be okay. It will be okay. We're here to help you. That's why I say it's very fulfilling to me to be here. Over the years, we have proven that we can be more than just a family-run organization because that's what we organize ourselves as. We don't have enough family participation. We don't have enough cases that come before us where a mother and or father is present at the meeting. But with the work of, that Gail has done, um, I think that these families feel a lot more a part of it and they have an actual say. We had a mom um, back in, I think, 2009 Somehow or another, she got a referral to our organization. I felt lost before I got with um, this program. Um, I, had, um, I had children in the system. Man, I've been up and down, up and down. I was on drugs before, and you know, and, and one time I wanted to commit suicide. I told Ms. Gill I was gonna kill myself, and she was over my house like, I mean, before I hung up that phone, it's like she was knocking on my front door. I had got with Miss Gail, and she taught me how to advocate for myself and for my children. And she kept telling me, just hold on, just hold on. We got this. We got this. You can't help them if you break down. Mom was upset. I said, Mom, let me be the lead on this. Let me try to figure out what we can do to convince these um, professionals that you still should see your child. So when we was around the table at Children's Hospital, Ms. Gill was there advocating for me. But I put on my advocacy hat and I saw an advocate for that parent so she could see her daughter. And I said, you put so many obstacles in her way and saying this is a condition that she has to meet before she can see the child and she has met him. So it's time for you guys to do something. After about a half an hour of wrangling with the judge, he agreed. He said, Ms. Avent, I'm writing a court order today. And 
this mom can see her daughter today and you can supervise a visit. And before I left Children's Hospital that day, I got to see my daughter that same day. So the mom was so happy. And um, after a few years of treatment, they've been reunited. So one by one, all her kids started coming back to her. And ever since then, I've been going forward, fight. And I ain't let go since. As a small organization, as a family-ran organization, as an organization actually uh, not knowing I would be sitting here today saying that I'm being honored by the National Federation of Family it is amazing to me because when I started out in this, this work, I just saw it as something to help uh, families. I couldn't be happier, really. I mean, we need more recognition, especially when it's as well-deserved as it is in the case of total family care. I think that um, it's a real testament to the work that they've been able to accomplish in this city, and I'm just so proud to be working with them. Well, I think it cannot go to a better person other than me, you know. <laughs> oh, that she in good company when I say other than me. I really believe that it cannot happen to a better person. So um, I just, um, I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm glad to be a part of um, her um, getting this award and just uh, that Gail just keeps growing and developing. And pe when people come to Total Family Care Coalition, they walk away with the three things. I'm going to stand with them, I'm committed to them, and I'm going to be there. I'm going to be there. When there's a crisis, they know they can call me. This organization was the best thing that could have ever happened for me. And, you know, I feel much better. I feel so much better. So much better. Total Family Care has changed lives and will continue to do the work that makes the world better. And for that, we congratulate and salute you, Gail Avent, and Total Family Care Coalition for making a difference in the community.